What's up guys, this is multi 24 gaming and I'm here with part 2 for my Soundflower tutorial. Um, and so, what we're going to be doing is I'm going to show you what settings you're going to use for different things. Now, I've had serious issues with this, um, mostly regarding uh, like sound, me, my voice being too quiet, airplane engines being too loud, like an example being like, here we are, this video here, airplane engines. There's that, and then there's also, you know, Unturned, which is very, way, way quieter. So if you haven't seen my previous video on how to download and install Soundflower, I recommend you do it. Um, here's a hyperlink. And so what you're going to do is, you, after you've got it all installed and you've watched my other video and set all those things, you're going to open Audio MIDI Setup. Uh, for some reason, it won't open twice. Okay. And so you've got, let's see wrong button, I meant system preferences, go away, okay, system preferences, sound, you've got that there, and so, basically, make sure that you have your input at aggregate device and your output as multi-output device in your sound preferences, uh, for, um, in system preferences, and here, I've looked through this multiple times, and these seem to be the settings that work for me, okay, so I'm going to click through them, I've already show, like, shown you how to make the multi-output device and aggregate device in my previous video. Soundflower 64 channel, don't mess with it. Soundflower 2 channel, these are the two things that I use. 621 on the master for output, and that's the everything else is full value. So uh, 0.621 is what I meant, I apologize. Log me in remote sound, just everything is fully up. I'm not exactly sure what that does, but it hasn't affected me. Um, now built-in microphone and built-in output aren't relevant if you're not using your built-in microphone and built-in output. Right now, I'm using, as you can see, Turtle Beach PX22. Those are my headphones. So I'm using that to listen to sound and also to speak because I have a microphone attached to it. So if you guys are using just built-in, like on your Mac, you've got a built-in um, speaker and a built-in you know microphone then what you're gonna do is you're gonna adjust these settings accordingly rather than the turtle beach settings but here i will show you what settings work for me so here input and output settings um, the input is how loud your voice is so how loud uh... the microphone is picking up your voice so i believe my voice will get way way louder and obnoxious if i do this but at the point at the current moment i want to keep it at four sixty seven because that seems to be what works now if you you want to balance these out okay so for extreme landings output the airplane engines are extremely extremely loud so you want to have the output down much further than um the input you want your voice to be louder in comparison to the airplane engines now let's say you're playing unturned or minecraft minecraft doesn't have a constant in your ears and you can you know hear sounds and sounds are a lot quieter in that game so what you're gonna do is you're gonna make the output louder and you're gonna bring the input down so um my settings for unturned i've even recorded myself a little video showing me the settings um, up here, for unturned, this is what I use. I use 505 for output and 133 for input. So my voice is much quieter than my friends' voices, and and like in comparison. Uh, but it it seems to all average out in the video that I record. This is for extreme landings here. Uh, I was playing music while I did it. Here are the different settings. Um, as you can see, same general area for Soundflower 2 channel. I'll flip through these two. So there we are. You can pause the video if you need to. These are the current settings for extreme landings. Um, but th those are the important ones right there. But um, so when you're when and also like racing games, basically what you have to do is you have to like take these general settings, okay? So take loud race car engines. Take these settings. Uh, Portal 2, where people are talking to you in the game, take, like, make 
the output louder, the input a little quieter, and you'll have to record a couple test videos to see how what works. And then after that, what you want to do is record, of course, record yourself a video, like I did. All settings, I recorded all settings, and now I have all the settings that work for me. Now another thing that um, came as a little confusing to some people. I think I may have screwed some of my audio up. Let's just see. No, no. Anyway. What has confused myself multiple times and other people that I know of is um, the fact that sometimes when they're using their headphones, it'll s it like Soundflower will make it so audio from the game only happens when you speak. Um, now that took me a good three months to figure out, and the answer to that is it doesn't. It's just your headphones noise canceling. Um, so your headphones will cancel noise, uh, and white noise such as airplane, car engines, you know, crickets in unturned is canceled out in your headphones. But once you pull those things off and um, everything like that, then, you know, the sound is just completely normal. So like I said, I'm going to go through it one more time. If you've got, you know, you're playing Extreme Landings or something, output, sound coming out of the speakers out of the game you want to be much quieter and the sound coming from your microphone your voice being much louder alright um, and also another thing that seems to confuse some people is Skype now that's happened to me multiple times too where my friends and I've been talking and their voices are like dead, definitely quiet is that a word uh, but you're gonna go to microphone and you're gonna change it from whatever it is to aggravate device and the aggravate device, as you can see here, is already knows that it needs to call to your microphone to get your stuff, right? Basically what it's doing is it's saying, okay, I'm going to pull stuff from both Turtle Beach PX22 and Soundflower, which is connected to multi-output device. That's the logistics of it, but um, y that's not really that important. Just make sure microphone is aggravate device and... Uh, not ringing, I don't think matters. Speakers is multi output device. And then take a few test videos and adjust the settings accordingly. Alright? So uh, I really hope this video helped you. Um, please let me know in the comments if I, if, if anything was, um, if anything was, got switched around or if, if you know better than me because I'm just here to try and do my best to help you guys, um, help you guys not have the same problems I did. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know in the comments if you have any questions, and I will do my best to help you figure it out. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time.